Welcome to today's video blog, where I'm gonna to talk to you about six things that make a successful business. Recently, I've been thinking a lot about what makes a successful business, what makes a successful entrepreneur. And I wanted to share these findings with you because I think they're fundamental in everything that you do. And they're fundamental in what we do and what makes us successful. And these things are, number one, number one is to follow your instinct. And what I mean by instinct is, you know when you just know and you get that kind of feeling and you think, oh my God, I should do that. But then your logical mind kicks in and you go, oh no, I shouldn't do that or this reason or that reason. What actually would happen if you followed your instinct? Because I've taken some big risks over the time and I've actually stepped in and followed my instinct. I've taken some really amazing trips and journeys by following my instinct and just going with it no matter what, no matter where it took me. And I just trusted that everything would be okay. And you know what? It was okay. And it was some of the best experiences in my life. And with this business is one of them. Following your instinct is the most powerful thing you can do. So if you're not following your instinct, just for one day, why don't you try it out? I bet you some amazing big shifts happen if you start following your instincts. Follow your passion. Now, these two things are very similar and one way to follow your passion is to work out, ask yourself, what is the one thing that you were really stirred up about or felt angry about when you watched television or watched the internet? For me, it's animal cruelty. If I see something to do with animals or somebody being bullied or something being, someone being cruel to someone, I get my blood boils and I get really, really angry. So I know that deep down my passion is about helping animals. It's about rescuing. It's about giving back in that way. And the same with our community. When we do anything, we've got a fundamental part where we love to give back. We love to help in those areas. And so I want to ask you, are you living your passion? What excites you? Do you get up at the very beginning of the day and think, oh my God, I'm so excited to jump out of bed. I'm going to create an amazing day. And I know that that's sometimes hard to do because you wake up and you go, oh my God, I've got all these things to do and I've got these bills to pay. But when you start shifting and you go, you know what, I'm excited about the day I'm about to create because I can create anything I want. Really, you can create anything you want. From the moment you get up to the moment you go to bed, you can create anything you want. So start creating your day the way that you want it. Add things that excite you, that have your passion ignited and follow your instinct. The other thing is curiosity. Curiosity is a fantastic way to keep yourself engaged, keeps you interested and you learn more things. So curiosity is a really important thing. Courage. Another one of is courage. Number five is courage. Because it takes courage to follow your passion. It takes courage to just step in and follow your instincts. It takes courage to just know and trust in yourself. And the last one is how to help people. What can you do that can help somebody else? What can you do in your life, in your business, that can give back to somebody else? It doesn't matter what industry you're in, because I came from a creative industry where I used to think, oh my God, I'm in a creative industry, I'm in film, I'm in television, but I completely turned it around. When I started to look at what other people needed out there and how I could empower them and mentor them, everything shifted. And that's exactly what you can do too. So it doesn't matter if you're a beautician, it doesn't matter whatever you do in your life, styling, if you're if you are a healer, if you do counselling, you can help people and you can put it into a way that serves you and serves other people. I hope you got something out of this blog. It's six, it might seem simple, but ask yourself, what important things do you need to put in your day for you to feel inspired, engaged, following your passion, following your instinct, keeping curious and stepping into that courage. See you next time.